welcome to my channel again <laughs> i know it's been a long time coming but there will be consistent videos uploaded i am still learning how to edit so bear with me um right now in life i'm going through a lot so i'm not gonna lie and i was like you know what you really want to be on youtube Stop making excuses, get on YouTube, regardless of what you're going through. So today is the first time I've worn makeup in a few days. And this is the finished look. I hope you guys like it. I'm gonna show you how I created it. And let's just jump right into the video. Welcome to my channel. Thank you for stopping by. All right, ready, set, go. Let's get jump into these brows. No, ma'am, no, ma'am. All right, you're gonna draw a line. Don't press too hard, girl. I don't know how to do brow job. We're just getting them together. We're learning together, girl. So learn with me and bear with me. Come on. You got it, girl. Get in there. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, girl, that's kind of high. No, ma'am. All right, the spoolie will save lives. Spoolie save lives, girl. Make it make sense. Get in there. All right, we're going in with the crane case. Yes, yes, yes. Shade 03. Zero 05. All right, take a brush that looks like that. I have no idea what kind of brush that is, you guys. All right, you guys, pretend that you are making a sandwich, girl, and get that concealer. You are going to take the spoon and just glide it across. Glide the mayonnaise, glide the peanut butter, whatever you like, girl. Get up in there. All you're doing is gliding it, okay? Now, I don't set my concealer with powder at all. I just use a fluffy brush, any brush that you can afford. Get in there, tap it out. You don't want no creases, girl. No creases, baby. Now we're going to go in with my Watch Me Blush palette from the Crank Case. Shout out to them. You're going to go in with that Cocoa shade. And use any brush you can afford. Um, Elf is good. Wet n Wild is good. And also the Crank Case has a seven piece that's bomb.com, baby. All you're going to do is tap, tap, tap. I like to call it packing and I like to sing the backpack song. Backpack, 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 backpack. All right, so you're packing. Now you're going to go in with a fluffy brush. Or a brush of your choice and just tap in that berry shade we're gonna go back into the berry shade girl and we're going to tap it in there right now I'm building up the color eventually you will blend but right now we're just building up your color girl tap 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 all right now we're switching over to the map book you guys I slept on this I should have got it a long time ago get it girl if you don't have it go get it I'm showing off the colors right here Okay, now go into that brown shade, and all you're gonna do is tap, tap, tap. Remember, back, 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 uh, back, 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 back. Hey, all right, now I already said this, but you're gonna keep tapping for your life, okay? You're never done. It's even when you think you're done, it's not done, girl, okay? Tap, tap, tap. Now that tapping motion is blending it out. Keep going, girl, keep going. tap it out now when you're blending it out you don't have to keep dipping back into the palette when I'm dipping back into the palette I'm building color and when you're trying to blend it out you want to either a clean brush or um, just use the brush and um, tap tap off the access hope y'all are still with me we're rocking and rolling we're getting it done you're gonna blend it out and trust the process you guys you have to trust the process keep blending keep tapping remember tapping is going to get the job done it's going to blend it out but sometimes you can go in circular motions i remember i used to always go into circular motions but for me i have more control when i'm actually tapping At the crease, we're going to use P. Louise. You guys, please, please, please shop with them. Bomb, bomb, bomb ass base. Okay? Now, we're going to use the same exact technique as far as spreading the mayonnaise or spreading the whatever you want to spread, girl. Spread the peanut butter and jelly. Okay? To do the crease. Now, this is how I do my fast cut creases. This day, I was in a rush. So, all you're going to do is basically fill for the, your um eyeball. Okay? Um, I don't know why I couldn't think of eyeball. <laughs> But yeah, I'm showing y'all P. Louise packaging again. You guys, when you purchase from them, buy in bulk. That's the only thing I regret. I got the Secret Center palette, and I also got the P. Louise base, but I wish I would have purchased in bulk because it is overseas. So um, purchase in bulk when you buy from them. This base is bomb.com, honey. 
Don't sleep on them. All right, so you're spreading the mayonnaise or spreading the peanut butter. All right. Take your time with this, you guys. Yes, I dance, girl. Don't even worry about it, girl. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Now, boom, boom, boom. Keep spreading, keep spreading, keep spreading it. You know, one side of the sandwich has too much peanut butter. You got to spread it and make it even. That's what we're doing right now, okay? We're doing the same thing over there. Ooh, make it make sense, girl. Make it make sense. Mm -hmm. All right. Now, those edges, you guys. All right, so on this part, I like to, when I get to that part, I don't like to go all the way over. You could close it if you want to. That's your preference, but I like to use my hands to tap that out so it's not too tacky. Now, I'm going back in with the matte book. You're going to use a brown shade. Take any fluffy brush. I believe that that's my um, Morphe 433 brush. Are you going to tap it in your outer V? Tap, tap, tap. Backpack. Mm -mm. There's no backpacks in sight, girl, but backpack, backpack. Ay, ay, ay. Tap, 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 tap. Now, when I blend it out, I don't know why I'm, I don't know why I'm tapping, but you guys are. Ay, ay. But look, so you're going back into another brown. Now, when I'm blending it over, I do use circular motions. Now, when I'm using circular motions, I like to think about wax on, wax off, okay? round and round now i'm using my watch me blush palette you're going to dip into the only blue shade in the palette the shimmery blue and you're basically just tapping it on and also using those mayonnaise motions you're spreading the peanut butter girl spread that blue around yes now you're going to use that gold shade Ooh, girl yes make it pop make it pop do what you have to do do what you have to do get in there yeah yeah all right what are you doing tell me you're packing girl and then you're spreading packing and spreading making sure you're blending those colors together so it makes sense all right good now, it's important to make sure that your crease looks bomb. So, take your time with that. Sometimes, I don't use that brush. I use that same brush to go on my corners, like to hit the crease. But sometimes, I like to take a fluffy brush. But today, I was being lazy. Like I said, this is the fast cut crease. Um, the fluffy brush, when packing the color on, looks really, really good on the lid. So, take that same brush right there along the edges of the crease, but then use a fluffy brush. I'll show you what I mean in, in future tutorials. All right, so we're still gonna we're gonna jump back into the matte book, taking that brown shade, and now we're gonna do wax on, wax off. A, hey, let me know the name of the movie that's on down below. Drop a heart if you're liking this so far. A, hey. all right. As you see, I'm kind of taking above my crease a little bit, darkening that up a little bit. And then I'm going back in with the gold. Y'all, it's very important that you, you lose color when you blend. Sometimes you lose that color, girl. It's time for you to dip it back into the, dip that brush back in there and get the color. If you want that color payoff, you have to work for it. You can't just do it one time. You got to go back and forth, back and forth. All right. Now we're just waxing on, waxing off. And every so often we're packing, packing, packing. Back, pack, back, pack. All right. repeat basically you keep doing the same exact thing until you like what you see girl all right so i'm taking my favorite wipes by neutrogena the blue package you guys i've tried all of them but the blue pack is my favorite one and that's how i clean up my edges i know that i can use tape but i just something about pulling the tape off i'd rather just use the makeup wipe you girl if you like tape drop an orange heart i might revisit the tape see if that, that works for me nowadays tap off the access so right now you really shouldn't have nothing on your brush i know it looks like a lot girl because my brushes are dirty
you guys to apply, apply glitter I go ahead and use the applicator to an old eyeliner just make sure you clean it now that glitter is from Kiki Adams I absolutely love her shout out to Kiki she has um, a glow up Academy on Instagram follow glow up Academy and those are the glitters you guys when I first got it I, lo I absolutely love the glitters but it was so hard to open up some of them because it was like stacked so girl I had a hard time <laughs> But once you get them open, once I got them open, it was perfectly fine. I have no issues. I'll keep doing that every time I buy them. <laughs> but yes, girl. Okay, so right now we're using the NYX primer. Shout out to NYX. And we're just gliding across right above my crease. All right, so the glitters are from the Halo Stack bomb.com all right so when i pack my glitters i just pack i don't really swipe i pack first then i swipe a little bit to fill in okay so that's all i'm doing is pack 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 and then sometimes i dip back in and swipe over let's jump right into liner all right so it takes me a not a while but i just i like to work in sections for liner as you can see here wing it out girl i'm gonna do a detailed wing liner as well so we're not gonna i'm not gonna do too much tips and tricks here but just showing y'all how i get it done okay all righty then check out my ig it will be posted on here i always go live on there so if you don't see me on here i'm on there but i promise you these videos will be coming back to back at least one, one i'm gonna try to do one a week to start off with you guys let's get in there kind of slow all right i like to take my makeup wipe the same makeup wipe y'all use the same makeup wipe the whole damn time okay make sure you winging it out girl now you're gonna go ahead and put some mascara girl i have a funny story about my lashes and why i don't have too many lashes girl we're gonna go do a story time too on here <laughs> now i go in with the maybelline master prime i believe that's what it's called probably too but too much on there but it is what it is girl how you like me now rub it in rub a dub dub in the tub baby uh make sure you're clean another thing make sure you're brushing those teeth before you do your makeup application okay and make sure you moisturize ladies all right so what kind of toothpaste do you use drop that below i use crest all right now moving on we're gonna use any orange concealer you have this happens to be la girl all right Cover up those bags, girl. Get in there. Yeah, yeah. Use a beauty blender. Why well, can't I beauty blender? Beauty. Beauty blender. <laughs> All right, now we're using um, Classic Ivory. This is a step that you don't have to take. I'm just extra SF, girl. I use the same beauty blender. I use my orange to, to blend it out. All right, now we're going into lashes, y'all. I've been struggling with lashes. Like, I don't know what's going on, girl. But I'd be happy when I get them on. You'll see my little dance that I do. All right, so I'm using the Black Opal Foundation. Boom, boom, boom. Y'all, I love this foundation when I first put it on. But I wore it for about two weeks. And my skin is oily, y'all. It looks like you can melt some chicken on my face. Like if I went to Popeye's and they just slapped me. No, Popeye's is not that oily. Church is yes like i went to churches and it just baked on my face you know what i mean but you guys i love the way it looks so i'm not even gonna lie y'all i'll be wearing it still but i just have to make sure i make sure you have some a good powder so if you're dry this is the perfect foundation for you go ahead and get it girl my dry girls where you at uh uh purple hearts down below if you dry girl if you oily let's do a green heart girl now i'm taking my insta pop girl now when i mess up i always go <laughs> so um it is what it is girl all right so i take my insta pop brush which is the orange brush from real techniques shout out to them um now this other brush i always do down my nose y'all my big nose we're gonna go ahead and use a different brush for that it takes a special kind of brush for that nose no, i'm just kidding but um that's an elf brush get it it's bomb.com now we're going back in with your la girl can oh no, i'm lying to you that is from the crankcase bomb.com um shade 03 and 05 i mix them okay and then we're gonna go in with a beauty blender and we're going to tap that out girl tap it out tap it out nobody's around you say baby i love you <clears throat> i miss that 
all right now um, we're gonna go in with chalk dust you guys this is one of my favorite setting powders i just picked it up about a month ago bomb.com i also like what's the other one um dang, i can't remember sasha sasha buttercup get you either or but you guys right now this one is winning for me shout out to the print case okay and then you're just gonna wipe that powder away eventually girl. all right when you're blending out your concealer um i blend out mine i blend my mine out with the beauty blender but then i also take my foundation brush as you saw and then i go ahead and hit the edges of it to make sure it's all the way blended now also another quick tip when you're blending out your concealer make sure you're looking up before you set it because you don't want to set those creases girl and go back in and tap it in with the beauty blender and then set it with the with the um setting powder okay um do, do 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 okay boom 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 what else am i doing here do 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 all right take whatever fluffy brush you want and wipe that away girl get it off your face do whatever you have to do to get it off girl yes wipe 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 away girl i don't have a sign for that now i'm using my benai pa palette you guys if you're a makeup artist that is a bomb palette to have go ahead and get it you can get it from the MUA project if you're in Houston I'm located in Houston where are you from y'all let me know I use like I like to use Shay's topaz and golden light to bring that but y'all already know when y'all set y'all face your face looks kind of flat girl it looks kind of pancake-ish I need you to put some sun back in your face girl all right so now we're gonna use the NYX you already know shout out to them and we're gonna bronze up the skin get on that six head girl not a five head or a four head it is a six head we're gonna go ahead and embrace it y'all no matter what you have embrace it rock it love it share it with the world yes make sure it's blended though whatever you do all right make sure you're blending upwards for real though Y'all, when I blended down one time, it was like, no, 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 no. Mm -mm 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 -mm. It was more like, hell no. Hell no. No, stop. <laughs> All right. So, we're going to go in with Milani for the blush today. Aluminoso, baby. Now, we're going to go in with the crayon case again. Ooh, that was my first time ever trying it, you guys first time first reaction baby yes it was like yes now y'all take it real lightly because you do not need much uh, that's gonna last me a long time you guys i'll be forgetting sometimes and i just put it on it's like oh girl slow down slow down so take that real real unless you want to be bling bling every time i come over in your city bling bling unless you want to look like that which i don't mind looking like that y'all just depends on what it is all right, you guys, I didn't show me using the NYX setting spray to set my face, and then I just threw on the wig. Um, do, do, do. That's the finished look. This is the finished look. I hope you enjoy this tutorial, and um, stay tuned for more. Like I said, I'm going to be posting more weekly. These are a few looks that I've recently done. Yes, I decided to chop my hair off. Girl, it was dead. Let those ends go, girl. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. A lot planned for this channel and i hope you guys rock lean with it and rock with it and um, these are just a few looks i wanted to leave you with and boom 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 i think i got one more this is a natural look for me right here <laughs> um i'm working on my natural looks and we're working on these brows girl we got to get these brows together girl y'all got to give me some tips leave some tips below and this again is the last of it this is the last picture i'm gonna show up this look well goodbye see you guys soon have a blessed day.